Because I have it set up just like, you know, my cultivators, planter, you know, everything else. Mm -hmm. It just doesn't work with the overloader script, so I'm wondering if he has his pipe on full with, like, the, maybe, like, the pipe function? I don't know. Because, like, did he, did the cylinders he, don't he recognize when you press X, you know? It doesn't recognize the overloading unfold. Oh, yeah. So I'm assuming... I have to go back and look at it. I'm assuming he's using, like, the in-game P, like, pipe, to, like, open up your pipe or something. Maybe. I don't know. Sure made quick work of this field. Yeah, I mean, the 12 row, like, you don't think it's that big, but when you have two of them in the field, you're... I don't really know if you need 16. It's almost nice having the 12 row, because then Mike doesn't have to offset his cart all the time. I think if we were running two 16 rows, we'd be, you know, we would just be going, we wouldn't be, like, doing soybean and barley. We'd just be doing, like, corn and beans, basically. A lot of corn. Because that's about the same width as the Macdon, I think. The 16, probably. Where's Julian's 645 or 45 Macdon? Yeah, that's going to be so nice. I found out if you're going to use a 45 foot head, you're going to have to go in and uh, link the auger on the Flexion, by the way. A little short? It, it gets tight. Follow me, don't like it. You have to drive the tractor in front of the combine first. Yeah. And then scoot it over and slow the combine down, otherwise the tractor's going to get Probably because I was using the 9620. Where's that Niner X? Those, uh, those Nine R cabins need some work. I noticed on your RX that the cylinders on the side of the tractor don't move with the one of the turns. Yeah, it's not even fully scripted. It's not oh. scripted. <laughs> That's the why Nine R's are pretty that's why I never use it. I mean, all that's, it's just a new body and tracks. I mean, it doesn't have any, like, cylinders or IC or anything like that. You still got Ego as a good 8, 8R? Yeah, I have it. I mean, it's ready to get scripted. Right now, it's just, like, bare bones basic, but got to add in all, like, the IC stuff to it. But I'm surprised you never made a big stink about American Farming Photography is releasing as 7R and 8R. <laughs> Probably just never even heard of them. Probably, they're not as big a name as you. He found JDM one. <laughs> that guy, that guy cracks me up. You touch my mod? You no edit my deer. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, perfect time, and Mike's just getting back. I'm at 80. I'm going to take this thin sliver on my right. Okay, I'm going to go until I get close to being full. under that hood, I think. <laughs> yeah, need a T97 real through camel. I don't know if the T97 big floater tire one would actually fit close enough to the semi to dump that Kinsey. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
You'd have to yeah. really stretch that auger out. Or... Why is it that much bigger than the 9R? Oh yeah, those bears are huge. No, it's the same size as the 9R. Oh, the, the 9R? The 9R works fine. Yeah, it's Why like it's like exactly the same as the 9R, the wheel width. They look bigger. Man, we're just heaping this cart. I expect the Wilson trailers to have the heaped capacity because the Wilson trailer said that thing can hold 1,600 bushel heat. <laughs> Do not drive down a weight limit road. <laughs> yeah, if you go to the water line, it only holds like maybe 1,100 bushel, but yeah. if you heap it, yeah. yeah. Yeah, Do not areas. drive down the highway because you will be screwed. That's the only reason why I expected it at 54, because that's what it came out to around like 1600 bushel heap at 8 inches or something. That makes sense. DOT? Never heard of them. <laughs> so, I mean, I can lower it down, but I mean. I don't know. We, it's, the truck's pretty much heap, so it makes sense that you have them. Yeah. yeah, so I added like a, uh, on the fill plane, like 25 degree heap. Okay. So, I mean, if you put the tarp on it, it's sticking out over the tarp. But, yeah, it's full, definitely heat, so. I think it's pretty accurate, and it's really heavy on that truck, too. Yeah. If you load it up to 54. It ain't like that fuck modding one where they can run, what is it, a million liters? <laughs> oh. Otherwise, otherwise, a thousand bushel would be like, what, 38, 39,000? I think 32, whatever Raphael's card, I think it's like 33 or 34. Yeah. So it's quite a bit less if you only put a thousand bushel on. Oh, yeah. Talk about a lot of trips. You ain't gonna be able to sell them 1.8 million in three hours. No. But the trucks you definitely handle it a lot better, you know? Oh, yeah. Joe's just gonna have to wait over there. Yeah, it's a little bit big cart for that tractor, but it works. Well, if you had really rolly hills, I could understand it. This is, it let, it lug it pretty hard, and that tractor. I 
I mean, we're not dealing with that much slope in our fields, at least over here. No.